what is up everybody man it's been a terrible a terrible year this year just keeps getting worse and worse and worse and just when you think it's all gonna be over with it just keep getting worse and worse and worse well you read the title man um this is depressing news this is very depressing news so Warner Bros has once again delayed a lot of DC movies and changed the slate it's understandable it's just really depressing at this point as we all know the movie Dune is now going to be released in theaters hopefully because we don't know how long this is gonna um you know continue going on that comes out October 1st 2021 now that just took the Batman spot and now the Batman is going to be released on March 4th 2022 like dude you, you gotta be kidding me man first of all that October that October release date was so perfect for Batman now it's coming out in March of 2022. Y'all know how depressing that sounds? Like, we got all hyped up over that trailer at DC Fandom just for the movie to come out in 2022 now. Oh, that. And what's even worse is The Flash. What I'm really, really looking forward to. It's going to be a big DC event film. That was supposed to come out on June 3rd, 2022. Now, it comes out on November 4th, 2022. You can pretty much say it comes out in 2023. Because it comes out, like, at the end of 2022. Like, that's, that's, man. This is like the, this is like the 80th time The Flash has moved its release dates, by the way, but... Um, you know, last I heard that they were supposed to be filming in March of 2021. So even though they moved the release date for the movie, I hope they can still, um, start shooting or whatever. I can't wait to see, um, set photos, dude. Them set photos of Keaton and Baffleck and whoever else is going to be in that movie. Man, it's going to be off the chain, man. I'm telling you, that Flash movie is going, it's, it's, I don't know. I'm really excited for it. You know, I know a lot of people are scared of what they're probably going to do. Um, we'll see, though. We'll see. I'm, I, 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 I'd be lying if I said I wasn't a little, you know, scared of what they're going to do in the flash. But we'll wait and see, man. Um, other than that, I can't wait for it. I can't wait to see Keaton and I can't wait to see Baffleck back. But we will still we will. Well, we'll get to that in a minute. Because Shazam 2, now this is unbelievable right here. Shazam 2 moved to June 2nd. Get this, get this. June 2nd, 2023. Like, when, when, when you hear 2023, automatic pain just goes through your head. Like, I don't want to think of 2023. How, when I think of how old I'm going to be in 2023... That's just painful, man. That is just painful. 2023, I'm going to be... I'm not even going to say my age, but... I hate it. Pain. But apparently, the good news... They still could probably be, be shooting Shazam 2, Fury of the Gods, next year. So, that's good news. But they got to start shooting fast because those kids aren't getting any younger. You know what I mean? So, they got to start shooting that movie. Um... Or else, you know, Shazam 2, you know, the, the Shazam family, the kids, they're going to start having beards and stuff. You know what I mean? So, um, yeah. Uh, in other news, Jurassic World, Jurassic World just got a new release date. That now comes out on June 10th, 2022. So, it's a lot of movies that are just moving release dates right now. So, we're not getting any more movies this year at all. You know, Tenet was unfortunately the test and it failed. You know, when, when No Time to Die moved its release date, 
that's when everybody else followed suit. So <clears throat> it's going to be a minute. It's going to be a minute until we get, you know, a lot of movies in the theaters again. I really miss the movie theaters. So whenever they open back up, I beg of you all, do not take going to the movies for granted anymore if you did in the first place. That's one of my favorite pastimes is going to the movie theaters, man. It's just nothing like it. It really it really is nothing like it. I, I just don't know, like, when we're going to be able to, you know, go to the movies again. I, I, I have no idea. I wonder if we're ever going to be able to go to the movies again. It really don't look like it right now. Movies are going to die out. And that's unfortunate to say. But they're going to die out. And everything's going to be going to streaming soon. And that's just painful to think of. But at this route that we're going right now, streaming is going to be having these big blockbusters. I give it, you know, 10 years or so, probably. 10 years, maybe. Maybe less than that. I don't know. But I hate this. I hate this so much. Like, oh. It's just been, it's just been so depressing, man. This whole year is like, just, it's the worst year I've ever had. I'll tell you that right now. I can't think of a worse year than, than as long as I've been alive. Like, this has been the worst year. So, (sighs) give me y'all thoughts in the comment section down below. Also, I forgot to add, Black Adam does not have a release date anymore. As we all know, it was supposed to come out on december 22nd of 2021 but you know they took that off the release schedule so i don't know man um that's probably gonna take uh june 2022 release date hopefully maybe i saw that wb had a movie uh on their calendar that had june 2022 so we'll see man but this sucks big time there there is some good news out of this though there is some good news Zack Snyder's Justice League is still coming out in 2021. So, if there's one positive to take out of this, is that we're still going to be able to see Zack Snyder's Justice League. All right? On HBO Max. So, yeah. But everything else, we're just going to have to be patient, I guess. And I'm not a patient person, so. This is going to be a painful wait, especially after we just saw a lot of footage from some of these movies, especially the Batman. And now we got to wait even longer. (sighs) Sucks, man. Sucks big time. But give me y'all thoughts in the comment section down below. What do you think about these delays? And um, which movie are you more? um, Are you more sad about moving? Uh, let me know in the comments section down below. Make sure y'all subscribe. We're on the road to 10K. So if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you subscribe. Make sure y'all share this video. Make sure you like this video. And uh, I'll see y'all in the next video. All right.